G'day YouTube, Warbles on a lot here. We've got Fruit Loop and her Joey on the lawn. With a bit of a cameo by a wagtail. You gonna come over and say hello, Mr. Wagtail? Gonna tell us what the story is. Traditionally, you followers are the messengers. Yeah, there we go. Thank you, Mr. Wagtail. Wagtail on the windmill. Right. Okay, is that right? So this is proof that wild birds can handle wind turbines. Interesting argument, Mr. Wagtail. Thank you for putting it. Yep, wild birds and wind turbines. No problem there. Wild birds and swamp wallabies and wind turbines. Still no problem. Beautiful. And over there we have wrens. Bunch of wattle birds drinking at the swimming pool. Haven't seen one for a while, but we actually have a family of striated warblers that fly around with the grey fantails and the thrushes and the superb blue wrens. What I call the breakfast flock. And for some reason, a little swamp wallaby is really camera shy and hangs out on the other side of the mother fruit loop. Which is why I've been looking at the various birds yeah. I don't know whether we'll get much time looking at it, but over there, no, disappeared again. There was, in fact, yep, yeah, there it is. You're going to have to trust me on this. But that, oh, yes, thank you. <laughs> that was a grey fantail catching an insect. You've got to have the understory. Of shrubbery to sustain the insects to feed the birds so that you get the bird song to get the sound of the forest just exactly right and you've got to have the birds so that they can jump around on the tree branches and shake the dew that's condensed onto the leaves down onto the ground and water the forest floor you've got to have the birds you've got to have the understory it has to be a functional forest you can't have a simplified neat straight rose orderly monoculture and call that a forest. Isn't that right, little lily wagtail? It's particularly difficult keeping you in frame on telephoto. Uh -huh. That's why we can't see the jelly, it's in that pouch having a rest after it's morning in the sun. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Who do we have over here? Over there. At the buckets, having a drink. We have the same bull male that was here yesterday, and I recognise him. Now that's Floppy. Okay, so Floppy is about three years old. I remember Floppy here as a joey. He 
he's having a drink. I'm going to go and get some bread. And isn't it amazing what a little bit of bread does to the camera work? All of a sudden, Fruit Loop comes in close. Charlie Currawong comes over to get his part of the feed. I don't know where the floppy is going to come over. Put in a close up, maybe he will. Damn shame she's backlit like that, but I can't do anything about that. You want some more? Gives us a better shot, doesn't it? Hey, eh? that gives us a better shot. Oh, you're a good girl. Yes, you are. So do you reckon Floppy, the fox guard, is going to come over and talk to us? Come on, mate. I'm just throwing a piece of bread halfway between where he's sitting and where I am. And he's just looking at me, wriggling one ear. I don't know whether we're going to get a big fella coming in. She's seen me throw the bread, she knows it's over there somewhere. She's found one bit. And I'm afraid the other bit has just been grabbed by a cutter wall. Make your decision which one can you fly with.
Alright, if I'll do that. Caravan guys off with it. So there's still half a piece of bread at the base of the wind turbine turbulence test rig. Trying very hard to get bar. Oh, there we go. Now I've got both of them in the same frame. She can smell it. Wait there while I go and get you a potato. And the answer is yes, wobbles. Wallaby will wait for potato. Sorry about that, I was throwing bread to a big fella, but he's not taking it. asking here. See, I told you he remembers eating bread when he was young, or he remembers being in his mother's pouch while she was eating bread. Grey fantail doing aerobatics in the background there. I don't know whether you saw it. Grey fantail over there. Flying around. Fruit loop eating the potato. Thank you for that offer, Grey Fantail, but I'm not even going to try and film aerobatics on telephoto when it's backlit. Just doesn't work. Mm. He probably won't go into the windmill. Oh, well, he went into the electric windmill. minutes so I'm going to have to stop this fairly soon okay he's got a bit of bread and she heard the potato hit the windmill what's the matter where is it can't you find it Quickly, quickly, 57, 58, 15 minutes, gotta go. Ciao.